Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Now, I know what you're all thinking. There's absolutely no way, right? There's absolutely no way this is coming to pass. But guys, this has been suggested by many, many, many players. And not just players, but also a few creators have been suggesting this as well. And the developers have actually taken in this feedback. And it's getting added to the Chinese version as we speak. Just have a look at some of these skins for the vehicles that they're adding to the game. They look absolutely amazing, don't they? <laughs> right, guys, I'm kidding here. This was footage from Undawn, which I'm also playing on the side at the moment. But seriously, guys, do us a massive favour. Hit that subscribe button. We're going to discuss the possibility of vehicles in Arena Breakout. And just for a disclaimer here, guys, I have got no interest whatsoever in vehicles being added to Arena Breakout. I just want to discuss it, get, <coughs> excuse me, your all opinions on it, what you think about it as well. So anyway, let's get into the video. <laughs> So guys, as it stands, a lot of this video is going to be speculative and a lot of my opinions as well as opinions of our people that I've spoke to uh, in the course of the last week or so in regards to this subject. Now, as it stands, like I say, I think Farm, Valley, Northridge, Armory, etc. will not support vehicles. They're just, they're just simply not big enough. I'm talking cars, trucks you know, big lorries or something like that you get on Warzone and stuff. The terrain just won't support it. The maps are far too small. However, I can't dispute the comical appeal to drive and buy a squad on a BMX and gunning them down with your partner on the back or, you know, sniping a guy off his mountain bike. I think that would make some interesting content and it would be quite comical to do at the time, albeit a bit unrealistic to have a massive, you know, backpack and fully armor riding around on a tiny bicycle but that's by the by now the only real way i could foresee any sort of vehicle being ever added to this game and i mean drivable vehicles not wreckages lying about the road like i've seen right in front of me character right now i mean ones you can get in physically drive run people over get the extraction quicker is to have a much larger map now obviously you know the sizes of these maps you can get one end of the other in about 10 minutes flat so why the hell would you need a car to do that anyway so you would need a big big map for example a wrangle on pubg mobile but this would of course bring with it a lot of different things that would be against the the player style of the game for instance it would turn more like a battle royale as opposed to a looter shooter if you had a game map that big how would you handle extracts how would you handle game time you know the time i run out and stuff if it's going to take you all day to run across the map without a vehicle What's the point in even spawning into this map in the first place? Yes, maybe there's um, sort of lots of loot to be found, v towns and stuff like that. You can drive between them. But I think the only way you could do this really is to have a continuous map, just like Lost Lights got at the moment, where you spawn into an already running match, which doesn't necessarily have a time limit, loot respawns, etc. And you can just extract it will, which I do like the idea of. I do like that sort of map. A big one at least being added to Arena Breakout, but I don't think that it should have cars on it, but that's that. But, like I say guys, there is a lot of updates coming in the future to the game. I have, I do talk to the developers quite a lot, or at least the admin reps, etc. I do talk to one developer specifically when he does reply, but there's no sort of inclination that vehicles are going to get added any time in the future. And I hope it stays that way. I have enough getting killed by extract campers or bush campers or people who have got simply better aim than me without getting ran over by a car while I'm looting a dead body in the middle of a field because they're going 90 miles per hour in one direction and they just don't happen to see us or they do and they deliberately run us over. It would just ruin the whole game. But anyway, guys, it's going to be a short video though, dear. I just wanted to kind of do that little bit of joke at the start of the video and get all your opinions down in the comments. Do you think vehicles should be added to the game and do you think we 
should get a really large map with a continuous raid going on all the time like a sort of drop and play where you can drop in and extract it will i do think that would be a really good idea anyway guys let's know down in the comments love to know if you haven't already liked the video guys make sure you subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye bye for now